The new aptly named Lick and Layers canine puzzle has quickly become a favorite in our house. Often I'll just place kibble in the many little compartments and use this toy as a slow feeder. After all, Forrest isn't allowed to eat straight from a bowl or he'll vomit up his entire meal. But you can tell that this toy was designed for more than just problem solving and slow feeding. All three layers of the Lick and Layers toy have different shaped compartments in which you can smear dog safe peanut butter, cottage cheese, mashed banana, and more. If your pup has a sensitive stomach, don't count this one out. You can simply fill it with their normal food, whether you feed dry kibble, wet food, or raw food. One of my favorite tricks is to add water to my dog's normal kibble, let it soak for several minutes to an hour, then place it inside the toy and freeze it overnight. When you remove the toy from the freezer, it will take your dog extra time to eat up all of those snacks, but you don't have to worry about tummy issues. Just easy enriching breakfast for tomorrow. The Lick and Layers toy is a perfect reminder that puzzles don't have to be hard for them to be enjoyable, and enrichment shouldn't be judged for how long it does or doesn't take a dog to solve or complete. Instead, we should be encouraging our dogs to participate in natural behaviors that engage their body and their mind. If there's a drawback to this toy, it's that it can be tedious to clean compared to many of the others that we've reviewed in the past. After all, there are over 100 compartments to wipe out, but in my opinion, that's a small price to pay. This toy seems to be appropriate for all ages, sizes, and breeds of dogs, and you can be as creative as you want with the food that you use, as long as it's safe for them, of course. So every time you give it to them, you can fill it with something new. So what other foods can you think of to use with this toy? Tell me your ideas in the comments. No matter what you pick, I'm sure this toy will be a winner.